In this video, we will discuss sending our exports from ImageMatch through RipLinks. Before you begin, you will want to have an active license with ImageMatch and RipLinks from either your lab or PhotoLinks, a completed job inside of ImageMatch, which has matching images and data, and any green screen work and crops applied, as well as a RipLinks configuration set up with ImageMatch directed to read this configuration. The first step we will want to do is to have our completed job open inside of ImageMatch. From here, we will go to Export, then Export. Once you're inside your Export Selection screen, browse out for your export from the list towards the bottom of your screen. Keep in mind that RipLinks cannot read from your, any exports from your recent export list, so it is important that you choose your export from the bottom list. You can either use your scroll bar to find this export or start typing the name of the export in the filter. Select your export, select your sort, and place a check mark next to Send Export to RipLinks. Press the OK button to then browse out to where you want to save your folder of exports. Go through any on screen prompts for your export. This will then create a RipLinks XML file. Once you are ready for RipLinks to begin your export, simply open RipLinks. If you have more than one print job or export sent to RipLinks, you will see them queue up in line and be rendered in the proper queue order. Doing this will free up your image match to allow you to work on other jobs while RipLinks works on the exports for you.